from my, from my leg now, so from here. Anytime you're in this position, and I push off his head, what does he think? Darn right. Watch my left leg go. Pulls back. I push the head and go to here, and I press the arm. I'm already in my leg now, but I cannot finish it here. Fight me. You see how many videos on YouTube where the guy goes, I'll just pull his arm across here. You are not. They'll fight me. Get out of here with that garbage. <laughs> but watch how you do it. Watch this carefully. Kick the head down. Watch that arm. It comes right out. Nice. Because when my leg extends, now my quad. He, this, he's pushing down, right? Even if my leg extends, nothing happens, right? My quad's going to win here. Or him, sorry, his arm's gonna win here because my quad's fully extended, right? Yep. But when I pull him tight and turn and now extend that quad, look where that arm goes. Feeds it right to me, I turn his palm away and it's right there. So that's entry one, that's entry one. But did you see the back swim? Mm -hmm. You gotta hit it quick, I'm gonna go this one more time. We're, this is gonna be a wild change. So bear with me, this is my last, my last few moments with you guys for the seminar, so I hope you like it. So, I might have a seat belt, doesn't matter. By the way, anytime you have a seatbelt, make sure your, your underhook. It, pretty nice, let's not get into that. <laughs> Too much detail. Let's focus on the leg now. So, right, so I'm here, I push off the head, I'm pulling back into the bicep. You understand? I'm pulling back into the bicep. When I push off, I'm not going sideways, I'm coming back to here, and I get rid of this arm quick. Dale, can you fight me? And if you roll, he just gave it to me. You understand? That's a proper leg Nelson. You are not going to leg Nelson anybody on this planet by sitting here going, oh, let me go get fighting, 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 be strong. And if you know me, you know I'm not a weak individual. I'm one freaking powerlifting championship in Afghanistan. I can't get his arm. I can't do it. So where's the technique in that anyways? If you have to try that hard, that's not technique. Watch. My leg's extended and I have no power. But when I bend my leg back and I kickstart his head, watch. See how I can extend my leg now? My quad is gonna beat his arm. Now fight me. Easy as pie. Turn the palm away and finish. So I want you to try that first. And then we're going to work it from a body scissor into a really nasty series back into leg locks from there. We're going to attack the body head to toe real quick. It's not going to be as complicated as you think. It's going to be fun. I want you guys to be able to hit it though, because this is a doable submission. Okay. Sean was doing a roll with a high level guy, one of your best students. And he actually did the, the you guys ever seen the Kazushi Sakuraba roll where he hooks the guy's legs in, rolls him completely over his arms, legs are over the guy's arm, pulls the head. Yeah, he's done that rolling live for real. If you drill something and you set it up right, you can do it. This is not a flashy move. There's nothing flashy about this. Actually, uh, Marcus uh, Almeida Buchecha did this. I saw it on a video a long time ago. I, I've done this before at a seminar, but I saw him do it too. And I'm like, it's funny, it's the exact same way. He's way better than I am, obviously, but it's the same way. This is how you have to hit this, okay? So give it a shot. Let's go, one, two, three.